Step one, trace your bra. So step one on itself is very simple but very important. And it is very, very important that you get it right. What you're gonna do is you're gonna go to the sides and then you're gonna find the stitches that are there um, from how the bra was sewn. If they don't have that, then you are just gonna have to fold it in half and trust that and perhaps even put a pin on it so that you don't lose that half. Then you're gonna set that aside and grab some paper to make the pattern. You can do what I did here, which is just stick three pieces of paper together in, for, in order to make this big piece of paper. And then what you're gonna do is take your bra, and I recommend you use a pencil, not a pen, or a marker, since you can sometimes seep uh, into the um, bra's fabric and it can look kind of funky. But if you're fine with that happening, then you can use whatever. Then what you're gonna do is you're just gonna simply cut the pattern out. Um, make sure that it's symmetrical, as you can see here. It is not, because I traced it really badly. But just take your time, if it is not symmetrical, if it is not right, then just redo it because trust me, you really do not want to sew this on your bra or your binder and then just be like, oh no, because it's too big or it's too small or there's missing fabric and so you have to do it all over again and it's just not worth it. Step two, cut out your fabric. So what you're gonna do is very simple. You're just gonna pin the pattern down on the fabric, or if you like tracing, then you can just trace it on the fabric. Make sure that the fabric that you use is fabric that isn't very stretchy, like at all, and that is comfortable for you to wear. It has to be really not stretchy at all. I used um, here a an old sweater I had because it was the most, um, <clears throat> comfortable fabric I had and it was the most similar to to the color of the original bra but you can use whatever as long as it is comfortable as long as it um is as long as it works for you and as long as it is not stretchy then it just you can just use it step three get everything ready to sew step three is just getting everything ready to start sewing you're just going to get all your things organized and all your materials and then you're just going to have to pin the cut out of the fabric onto the bra. If there's any extra fabric or if the cutout is too small, then um, you can just redo it or cut out the extra fabric. But make sure you take your time and really have the cutout to be um, the exact same size as the um, half of the binder. Also, make sure you pin it to the inner inner side of the of the bra, so that you, when you sew it, you don't sew the outer side because otherwise it will not work as well. Actually, it can work, but it can look a bit weird and it can be quite confusing when you put it on. So I just recommend you um sew it to the inner side, the inner front side of the bra. So I didn't um, record myself sewing the bra because I did it by hand, but what you're going to do is you're going to sew where you pin the bra and then uh, you can do it by machine or by hand, whatever works for you, but um, then you're just going to flip it and you're going to see how it works. If it doesn't work, then see what went wrong. Maybe it's a fabric or maybe it's a pattern, but as you can see, um, even by sewing it by hand um, works just as fine. Um, make sure you get the sewing pretty nicely. It is not that even for me, but just get it as even as possible so that it lasts longer and so that it's more secure. Thank you for watching this video. I am really, really sorry for making the person who waited for this video wait this long. I promised to do it before Christmas, but things got really messy with my family and also with, um, um, school and tests and everything. When I say my family, I mean like I got grounded. <laughs> so yeah, that wasn't great. But I really, really do hope that this video helps you um, make a binder. I hope uh, it was clear enough. And if it wasn't clear enough in some steps, I can answer some questions in the comments. Please also do your research before binding and um, make sure you do it correctly and safely. I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day. If this is midnight or 3am for you, go to fucking sleep. <laughs> and I'll see you in the next video.